Hi everyone, this video will show you how to make an Android backup on your Samsung Galaxy S3 with TWRP. You're watching Mobile Network Comparison. So before we do anything, we're going to have to check that we have root on our phone. We've got another video which there's a link to here on the video showing you how to root your Samsung Galaxy S3. but the method we're going to use today to make an Android backup requires root, so you need to verify that this is the case beforehand. Here, Root Checker is showing that the phone has got root access, so we can go ahead and continue with the process. So TWRP is the TeamWin recovery project. It's a custom recovery for Android phones, and we're going to install the version for the Samsung Galaxy S3 now. So the easiest way to do this is simply to visit the Play Store and search for TWRP. TeamWin's recovery has improved massively over the last few years and it's currently got an amazing interface and tons of options so it's what we really recommend for making backups and having as a custom recovery. So I'm just going to install the TWRP manager now. It says it requires root access but as we've just checked that's okay. This should be fine. It's now installed and I can click open. Okay so it's going to request root access so let it have it via SuperSU. Hit no here. And the easiest way to install TWRP is just to hit the TWRP install button on the menu and then you can choose your device name. So because we're running an international Samsung Galaxy S3, we need to make sure we choose exactly the right version number here and that's the i9300. Be really careful here, make sure this is your phone that you're using and it's the correct device name. So now we can actually go ahead and press install recovery. Here it's going to download the version of TWRP recovery that you requested for your particular handset. And I'm just going to fast forward through this quickly now because it's going to take a little while to download on my internet connection. And just to emphasize that point one more time because it is really important, please be very careful that you are certain you've chosen the right phone model for the version of TWRP you're downloading. Right, okay, we're just finishing off now the last few percent of the recovery. And now the final warning, double and triple check this is definitely the right partition for your phone before you hit yes. And just like that, the recovery is flashed automatically to your phone. And we can go to the menu again and just reboot straight into recovery from the options in TWRP manager. So reboot to recovery and I'm just going to let my phone boot up again. So the logo flashes up and we'll see that we're now in TeamWin recovery. And as you can see, the interface is really self-explanatory. We're going to go ahead and make an Android backup simply by hitting the backup button. It's really that simple. And it's a touchscreen interface. It's even got swipe gestures. It's kind of amazing. We're going to put compression on to make the backup file a bit smaller. Try and swipe to back up, and it's going to start doing this now. So the backing up process is going to take a little while. And again, we're just going to fast forward through this for you so you don't have to sit around waiting for too long. So while this is going, let us quickly explain to you what an Android backup is. So the great thing about an Android backup is that it's a complete backup of everything on your phone. We're talking the launcher, the apps, the software, the settings, the text messages, everything. Okay, so that's it. It's done. The whole process is finished and you'll find the backup file safely stored on your phone's memory. Thanks very much for watching this video. We really hope you found it useful. Please do leave us a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed it. Cheers.